Wentz and I are out here. We're gonna go rural shadowing in Burns Lake, BC. Some planes behind us. I think this one is ours. So beautiful. So yeah, such a cool opportunity. We'll show you our itinerary and they pay for everything, so it's pretty sick. Have anything to say? I'm excited. An hour and a half like without any entertainment. <laughs> Where to? To Smithers. Oh. Oh, here we go. Oh. Made it to Smithers. You. Yeah. Let's go. Look at that. This is where we are staying in Burns Lake. Very pretty. Again, complimentary Airbnb. Yay! <laughs> so exciting. Welcome. Could do some so work work. Lakefront hideaway. Oh, that looks so quaint. Fireplace. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So cute. First night. <clears throat> nice little dinner setup. Look at that. Ooh. Oh, we eating good at this uh, tandoori place. The view from outside our Airbnb. This is where we get to shadow rural family medicine. And <laughs> Quentin has it <laughs> to finish a presentation. So do I. <laughs> That's our Airbnb. And that's messy. Making breakfast with this view. Yummy. We got the coffee, got the eggs. <laughs> Not <laughs> going yet. <laughs> Today we're supposed to shadow, I think, doctors in the local hospital. Is that right? That's right. Two okay. of them. Two. Okay, well, we'll let you know how it goes. This is the hospital. It looks very modern. I'm quite impressed. What do you think, Quentin? I think it's newly built. Yeah. Government has money. Wow. All right, we just finished our shadowing. It was from 9 a.m. till noon. We're at A&W now on our lunch break. Um, how did we like it? It was okay. I started in a merge, so got a little experience there. What did you, what patients do you see? Like what kind of issues do they have? Mostly COPD, I would say. A okay. lot of like, yeah, chronic lung issues, some hypertension, pretty typical family sort of stuff. Yeah. Thing. Vasculopathy from smoking? Oh, yeah. You think, yeah? Yeah. Cool. yeah. A lot of um, diverticulitis actually too. Okay. Intestinal issue, colon? Um, I was with a family doctor. It was mostly uh, telehealth consults and uh, a lot of re-prescriptions for painkillers for a variety of issues, um, like arthritis. Yeah, yeah. I, I had re-prescriptions mostly for um, stomach issues, mm -hmm. pentoprazole, sort of like PPI stuff. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Very cool. Yeah. Some First Nations health problems. Um, a lot of claims to like work safe BC um, for EI. Just got uh, back from shadowing. More of the same. Some UTI. Some more refill prescription of methadone. Potentially harder stuff. Now we're going to dinner. Yay. Let's go. It's 5 p.m. <laughs> that was on the menu. What about you, Quentin? What do you think? Uh, it was fine, yeah. yeah. Some physical exam stuff, yes. cardio, I did shoulder MSK, musculoskeletal. And, uh, yeah. Let's go get food. Look at that dinner. Just had dinner with the docs. Pretty insightful. Mm -hmm. We learned to be nice to all healthcare professionals. That was the moral of the story, I think. <laughs> Pretty but, much. Yeah. Now we're off to a hike, Kager Lake. 
So beautiful weather. Excited to get some fresh air after a long day. <laughs> wow. Look at that view. After a day of rural medicine, this is what you can do. This is your reward at the end of a long work day. <sighs> nice fire. We're chilling. Rural medicine, I mean, if you like the outdoors, if you like, I mean, there's lots of mountain biking trails here. So lots of fishing, Burns Lake. <clears throat> yeah, mountain biking. There's tons of little rivers and hikes that you can do uh, snowboarding and skiing in the winter so if you're into that this is your playground welcome back this is day two of shadowing we went from burns lake and we're going to south side now on the ferry for a wellness tour we got our truck behind us <laughs> but yeah another day and then some more shadowing in the afternoon so yeah look at this made it to the Southside Health and Wellness Center. We parked one truck next to another truck. Right, Quentin? That's right. All right. This community is about 1,500 people mm -hmm. that they serve. And of course, if they need like x-ray, they need to go into Burns Lake, which is, I think, very rural as well. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's about like 80% indigenous and 20% non-indigenous. Three indigenous mm. bands. And then there's also like Mennonites and... And Mormons. Yeah. So. It has like a two funding system. <laughs> One of it is Northern Health, but it's mainly autonomous. So yeah, very cool to see. And here we're learning how to suture. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> oh. <laughs> what happened? Oh, I'm restarting. Oh, okay. Disaster. Looks lovely. <laughs> please, no. Please. <laughs> and Mama Bear with cubs. Come on, second cub, let's go. Yeah, cross. <gasps> The one that's left behind. Little straggler. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> now it's just posted. <laughs> well, one activity you can do post clinic mountain bike. Woo! Coming back for the all you can eat buffet at the Tika place. Chicken. Oh, tandoori place. Tandoori. Sorry. Yeah. Another stunner of an evening. Look at that. Absolutely gorgeous. Apparently, that's a 200k boat. They have a very nice submerged apartment. Look at these bays. This is the trauma bay. That's a nice one. Yeah. Super cool. And this is the minor procedure bay. Yeah. Super neat. Super empty though. Yeah. But yeah, shadowing in the emerge today. It's fun. Removed a toenail. Quentin put an IV in. <laughs> You'll get mess one. around with some, uh, little, what do we do? Mess around with, saw the ambulance. Oscilloscope? Yeah. Attraction. Yeah. So, cool. We'll be back. Uh, compartment, because we can, like, load it out with us. Oh. But, basically, yeah, it's going to be one one of us in the back here. Hello. And we've just got, like, this is our med kit here. That's so cool. You can see, like, kind of the basics of what we have. We just have, uh, mostly small things we just got hydrocortisone and dexamethasone oh, yeah. we have nitro on danzatron gravel narcan of course uh, totally. <laughs> that's cool it's like sweet thank you yeah no. oh my gosh i think the problems that you face up north um 
I mean, you have a lot more indigenous health issues. So uh, there's a lot of people coming in of that background with hypertension, but like severe hypertension. So bad that it's like 180 over 115. Um, there's a lot of osteoarthritis, a lot of rheumatoid arthritis, um, a lot of vasculopathy from smoking, for example. So uh, I feel like you know, it, it's, it can be rewarding because you're serving a very small population or you're serving a population that has limited access to care. Uh, and I mean, if you like doing stuff like this, just chilling by the fire, you know, uh, outside and you like, Burns Lake, there's huge mountain biking here. So if you like that, it could be your cup of tea. I mean, look at this view. It's pretty sick. Yeah. So, yeah, I really enjoyed my experience.